Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. What to do if the FBI calls you? If you receive a call claiming to be from the FBI, it is crucial to be cautious. The FBI typically does not call individuals out of the blue, especially not at unusual hours such as 2 a.m. Verify the identity. If someone claims to be an FBI agent over the phone, it is likely a scam. Genuine FBI agents will not call you to warn you or ask you to call back at a provided number. Instead, they might leave a business card or a note asking you to contact them. Scam Alert Scammers often impersonate FBI agents to exploit individuals. These scams can involve various tactics to make the call seem legitimate, such as suggesting you contact the FBI field office. However, legitimate law enforcement will not contact you in such a manner. Right to remain silent. If you are contacted by actual FBI agents, whether by phone or in person, you have the right to remain silent and consult with an attorney before speaking. It is generally advisable not to answer any questions without an attorney present. Requesting a warrant. If the FBI shows up at your door, ask if they have a warrant. You are not required to allow them to enter your home without a warrant. If they do have a warrant, you must comply, but you still have the right to remain silent and request an attorney. Documenting the interaction. Write down the name, agency, and telephone number of any officer who contacts or visits you. This documentation can be crucial if you need to refer back to the interaction later. Consulting an attorney. It is almost never to your advantage to speak to government agents without an attorney. An attorney can help you navigate the situation and protect your rights. If you have already spoken to agents, an attorney can still help mitigate any consequences. Staying calm and assertive. When interacting with law enforcement, it is important to stay calm and assertive. Clearly state that you will not answer questions and that you want to speak with a lawyer. Avoid being rude or aggressive, as this can escalate the situation. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.